In primetime news this evening, Financial Services Commission appoints special auditor as fraud scandal deepens at Stocks and Securities Limited. First year UWI nursing students ordered to resit exams. We'll explore why the Nursing Council of Jamaica has taken this tough stance. And death at a funeral. Man killed at cemetery during the burial of a family member. Good evening and welcome to primetime news on air and online at onespotmedia.com. I'm Giovanni Dennis. And I'm Janella Precious. With a preview of what's the coming business news, here's Andrea Chisholm. Janella, we have some good news this evening about the tourism industry. A major hotel will be hiring more people to work at one of its locations. And I'll uh, give you that and more in the business day. And with a preview of what's the coming sports, Jordan Fort is standing by. Well, Gio, a couple of uh, cricketing legends have spoken about the importance of building back the love for the game in the country after a celebrity match in St. Elizabeth on a Sunday. And there has been a major coaching casualty in the Jamaica Premier League. I'll tell you more in Primetime Sports Monday. And guys, the cold front is still here, I think, right, Gio? The cold Indeed. front is still here. Now, Romaine has a preview of what's to come in weather. Romaine? Yes, we still have that cold air across the area, but it is slowly evacuating, so we're expecting more warmer temperatures starting tomorrow. No! <laughs> and before the break, our feedback question. This evening we're asking, are you okay with receiving promotional text messages from companies you do not do business with? Give reasons for your answer. You can share comments online, facebook.com slash television Jamaica and tweet us at television jam one. Stay with us. Primetime News returns right after this break.